Hey guys, Dave. Nice to meet you. Nice All to meet right, you. buddy. How Just you doing? Just in time. How are you? You sure is done. Ready for me? It's ready for you finally. Boy, well, finally. All right. And you don't want to see me patch the ceiling. No, I'll take care of that. <laughs> Dave and I, Dave, I brought some supplies to pat that hole. It's in my truck. I'm going to go get it. And then we're going to take it over. Sounds right. good. Right. And I'm going to clean up. I'll see you guys later. Thank Let's you. do it. All right, Dave, we got everything that we need to take care of that patch. Okay. Not only are we going to create the patch, but we're also going to put the same texture back there again. We have like a half inch drywall, what we're going to use to cut the patch. And what we're going to use this uh, hole saw, which is about four inches, is that what we need there. And then we have the wood strap, which we're going to insert in there and screw it on both sides. And then we're going to screw in our patch. Okay. Because it's a such a small patch, we're going to use this dry mix and then we're going to use this uh, margin trowel because it's such a small patch. This will take care of the work. Okay, how about paint? Well, this is a different story. So we're going to take care of the patch. Once this is dry, it's going to look white, but it's not going to blend in perfectly with the existing ceiling. My suggestion for you is get like a gallon of white paint, put a coat on this whole ceiling, and it will be nice. You're not going to notice anything with that patch. Sounds good. Let's get to it. Let's go. Let's get it done. First, I'm going to cut the drywall to size with a hole saw. All right, Dave, you ready? I'm All ready. All right, I'm going to handle some screws and I'm going to have this piece of strap that we're going to insert one end and then we slide it this way. All right, Dave, the strap in there. So now what I want you to do, put one screw on each side of the strap, but do not go through the strap. Just a little less in there, yeah. Beautiful. Pretty good. So I got the, the patch with the true pretty drill screws. All you gotta do is do one at a time and screw right into the strap. All right, Dave, I have some of the dry mix ready for you. Okay. And I want you to use the margin trowel. What I want you to do, put a little bit at the tip of the trowel and push it in in the space between the patch. Yep, just give me some more. There we go. How's that? That looks pretty good. And now we're gonna let it sit for about 15 minutes. So why are we putting tape on here? Because the house moves constantly, so the tape will prevent the joints to open up. Notice that you can go in all different directions because this is how this pattern works. And remember, this has to be almost like flat. You're gonna just drag it out. It don't need to be perfect. It just needs to blend in. Just rough enough a little bit at the edges. That looks great. Perfect. It's done. This is gonna take about a couple hours to dry. Okay. Uh, let's clean up. Sounds good. Let's do that. Well, Dave, what do you think about that? The light looks great. Dave, I'm talking about the patch. You can't even tell there was a hole there. I know, now you know how to do the patches. You can use the technique for ceilings and the walls. Well, my wife will be happy to hear that. I bet. Well, thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Enjoy it. Thank you. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project. So be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button to make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.